day. My name is RVR Urliza. I will discuss the background and rationally. First, automation technology. Automation technology compresses all processes and work equipment that enable plants and system to run automatically. This include machine, apparatus, equipment, and other devices. The higher the degree of automation, the less intervention need to be performed by human to control the process. Second, reverse winding machine. Reverse winding machine is a device that accepts use beverages containers and return money to the user. Third, automated process. Process automation refers to the use of digital technology to perform a process or processes in order to accomplish a workflow or function. A wide variety of business processes and activities can be automated or more often they can be partially automated by human intervention at strategic points within workflows. Good day, this is the presentation of the Bacal and Rationale, which are the plastic bottles, recycled plastic bottles and automated blending machine for polyethylene terephthalate plastic. So, a plastic bottle is constructed from high density or low density plastics. Plastic bottles are typically used to store liquids such as water, soft drinks, motor oil, cooking oil, medicine, shampoo, milk, and drinks. The sizes ranges from a very small to large one. Second one is the recycled plastic bottle. So, we need to know that not all plastic bottles are recyclable or even reusable. And for us to be able to figure it out whether the plastic bottles are recyclable or not, it is very important for us to have a knowledge of the seven standard classifications for plastics and the recycling and reuse information of each type. The polyethylene terephthalate is one of the most commonly used plastic consumer product. Polyethylene terephthalate is only intended for single-use applications. Repeated use increases the risk of leaching and bacterial growth. Pet plastic is recyclable. About 25% of plastic bottles in the US today are recycled. The plastic bottle is crushed and then shredded into small flakes, which are the process to make new pet bottles or spun into a polyester fiber. So the last one is the reversed automated uh, vending machine for plastic bottles. A reverse vending machine is a machine where people can return empty beverages containers like bottles and cans for recycling. The machine often gives back a deposit or a fund amount to the end user. This is what makes a reverse vending machine. Instead of the user putting in money and getting out of product, the user puts a product in and gets out a monetary value. Reverse vending machines are automated way to collect and sort and handle and return a used string container. So, the purpose of the study is that there exists a suitable method to develop a machine that is dedicated for recycling plastic bottles, specifically those made of polyethylene terephthalate. By using this approach, the researchers would attempt to promote recycling of plastic bottles through a more convenient path and ensure a system wherein the consumer could benefit from the action. Good day, my name is Rema Valeros and we are talking about the problem statement. The development of a reverse vending machine for polyethylene terephthalate plastic bottles will help to answer the time efficiency, space efficiency, and manpower problems. First, what design parameters should we consider to develop the development of a reverse vending machine for polyethylene terephthalate plastic bottles? Second, what is the integration strategy to be used in the development of the prototype? Third, what development framework to adopt in the integration of the design elements? Fourth, 
what tests and evaluation parameters to be performed in determining the functionality and efficiency of the prototype. And the objectives of our study is first to design a reverse vending machine that will be able to recognize if the material inserted is PET plastic or not. Second, to develop a machine that will vend off equivalent amount after a successful transaction. Third, to test and troubleshoot the system using the given on the perspective view. Fourth, to evaluate the reverse vending machine for polyethylene terephthalate plastic bottles in terms of the following functionality, accuracy, and cost of effectiveness. This is the conceptual framework of our study. So, the input are the baseline research components identification and data gathering the second is the process which are the designing development implementation and evaluation the last one is the output which is the complete prototype that's all good day everyone i'm zimran b salvado and today i'm discussing about the review and literated literature Microcontroller-based solar-powered reverse vending machine. This project consists of PIC 16F8, 4A microcontroller, and two proximity sensor, and the solar power system. Automated reverse vending aluminum can crusher. It has the ability to display offline when the bin is already full, or if there is no money available. It efficiently reduce the can's volume by much as 30% of the original size and has a minimum transaction of one can. The machine was able to achieve the objectives set and was able to prove that it's reliable enough to place in the public. Two-way power microcontroller based plastic bottles, drop and tap reverse vending machine with stored value system using radio frequency identification scanner technology. This project controlled by a microcontroller, which is the heart of the system that directs the operation of various inputs, sensor and keypad and output, display and motors, devices attached to it. In this study, the machine consists of many sensors used when receiving cans into the system and in the checking system. There are two main structures in the reverse vending machine one size classification and four type classification. This work is focusing on type classification but details about size classification are mentioned as well because the price depends on the size of the cans or plastic bottles. Review and related literature. First, we have the development of reverse vending machine using recycled materials and Arduino microcontroller. The main function of the automatic sorting machine is to separate different materials found in waste streams and minimizing the amount of goods sent to landfills. The other one is the accuracy of sorting beverage cans and bottles for a reverse vending machine. This work is focusing on type classification but details about size classifications are mentioned as well because price depends on the size of the cans or plastic bottles.